Bowers Game Corner presents Gen Con Video Bonanza 2016. Brought to you by Gutshot Games and their Gen Con release, Headhunters, a collectible card game and a collectible toy. And Shoot Again Games, makers of Looting Atlantis and Conspiracy. Look for Pinball Showdown on Kickstarter soon. Also brought to you by the generous support of these companies and our fantastic Kickstarter backers. Oh, hi there, YouTube. I'm back again today for more of our Gen Con Bonanza Explosion Blowout. We're live at Gen Con 2016. I love it. I love it. Swim in it. And right now, we are at the Nabu Games booth with Brett talking about uh, what was a pretty decent-sized hit last year, Stockpile, but there's an expansion now, right? That's right. just came out. How's it going, Brett? Amazing. How is Gen Con going for you right now in this moment on Friday? It is awesome! Woo! Woo! Right. My voice is dead, by the way. What is, uh, what's the new expansion? Stock corruption. What is that? So, Stockpile Continuing Corruption just came out off of Kickstarter. We delivered it just a few weeks ago, and it adds four modules to Stockpile. So, it is all about continuing the insider trading theme, and we call it Continuing Corruption. So, what does it add? What's new? What's going on? So, let me show you the back of the box here. So, we have four modules, which include six custom dice. So, each round, the forecast of the market will be different. More bullish, more bearish, depending on what dice are rolled creates a lot more excitement round to round and greatly diversifies the strategy of holding stock or selling stock each round. Second thing it adds, bond cards. Bond cards can be purchased, commit cash up front, but create an engine of cash flow to fuel your future round investments. Third thing it adds, commodity cards and tax cards. Collect different types of commodities and earn huge endgame bonuses or dodge taxes and stick your opponents with costly endgame penalties. And lastly, of course, are new investors. People love these from the first game, and we've added a bunch of new investors themed from around the world who bring unique characters and abilities to the game. So is this uh, modular? Do you mix it all in? How does it work? It's all modular. You can add it all for one big strategic punch, or if you want, just grow on it slowly, add it piece by piece. All right. I know some people will not answer this, but I'm gonna, I ask anyway. Do you have a personal favorite? They're all spectacular, fantastic, but do you have a personal favorite module? Forecast Dice. Amazing. Everyone raves about them, and I'm no exception. They're my favorite. I will never play the game without them again, well, except if I'm giving demos. <laughs> all right. Thank you very much, Brett. Uh, so where can people learn more about Nabu Games? Come to NabuGames.com, check out what we're working on, subscribe to our mailing list, and definitely follow us on Twitter. Sounds very good. So if you're looking to get your uh, your stockpile on, be sure to check that one out. If you're enjoying this Gen Con coverage, please be sure to click on the subscribe button down below. And in the comments below, let me know, stocks, do you play them? And if you don't, why not? Do you play them? Absolutely, you have to. I mean, if you're trying to invest for your future, right? Just uh, keep it quiet on the insider information. I, I have always wanted to, but it's just oh, it's so daunting. It's so daunting. One of these days, though. One of these days. But let me know in the comments below. Stocks, do you play them? And as always, thanks for your time, YouTube. Right. This was brought to you by Headhunters from Gunshot Games, Pinball Showdown from Shoot Again Games, these great companies, and fans like you.